Elizabeth and I had a fight a few days ago, and right now I'm questioning the marriage. But Dr. Viviana is coming over, and the timing could not be better. Hopefully, she will apologize for the way she acted in front of the other couples, because it's not going to be a part of the marriage where that's OK to act like that. I feel like I'm at home. I grew up First around thing we're this. Do is shut up and listen. Watch the safety video. Um, just shut up for five minutes. I literally sorry. can never say anything without him just getting so I can't, I'm just, you can reprimand me. I don't have anything to say back right now. You can act like you don't care. That's fine. It's much easier to not care than actually care and you know talk about what happened and actually show some remorse. I need to reserve my energy for Dr. Viviana too. So if you have anything else to just yeah, I got, a, I got a lot of things to say and oh I'm continue discussing Beat them. Beat me down even more. I'm a horrible person. Please keep going. You and I can get mad at each other behind closed doors. It's a whole nother ball game when you ruin everybody else's day that's within earshot of you. You embarrass our marriage. You embarrass me personally. You've certainly embarrassed yourself. You embarrass the other couples. You embarrass everybody. When you told me to shut up in front of everyone, I was embarrassed. I felt stupid. And everyone around you think that that's OK and no one even says anything. Yeah, you're going to ruin everyone's no, day. It was OK. Then Your why mom? did anyone take up for me? Jamie. Why didn't anybody take up for me then? I'm so sick of this! I'm so sick of this. Go away then. Go away! Are you happy? No. Let me guess, you still have more to like rip me apart about, don't you? You still have more issues with me. Then go away! You've embarrassed me in front of everyone. You've made me look stupid in front of everyone. So yeah, I'm gonna react, I'm gonna defend myself. Yeah, I have days where I snap and you do too, but you don't do that to people. So yeah, Jamie, you know what? I did overreact and I was a bitch. You're right I was. And I own it 110%, I own that and I've, an ass of yourself. I know. I don't need you to sit here and point a finger at me like this, like you do all the time. I'm under a magnified glass with you. Why would I'm you so not tired. Let me finish. I haven't asked you to speak yet. Hey, you asked me ask what you. I want, so I'm going to tell you. I didn't need to No. Ask you to speak. Stop. This is a relationship. Stop. Stop. I think we have a visitor. I'm not meeting with any experts today. Oh, hi. Hello. How are you? Hi. Talking to anyone today. Viviana just arrived, and Beth is very standoffish. She doesn't want to talk to anybody. Jamie, are you open to talking? Sure. Frankly, I'm a little bit embarrassed. I think that we should respect the experts, the fact that they're taking time to be here and try to help us out, and they actually care. Is this how things normally are? It's very much like a roller coaster. Like, we're either up here on cloud nine or we're calling the marriage off, one of the two. So what um, happened? I was really upset at the way she acted while we were at the racetrack. And that's when I told her, like, you've got to shut up. This has gone into a really negative, unhealthy place. Yeah. But in all fairness to Elizabeth, I would love for her to be a part of this. I don't want to feel like we're talking about having her back. Right, right. Um, if you would be willing to invite her over. OK. Yeah, I'll ask her. Can you try that? Yeah, sure. Thank you. You're welcome. Would you like to just come out here? I don't, once again, I don't want to be beaten down today. You don't, so you're not going to be beaten down. Would you, you don't even have to say anything. Elizabeth, this is not about beating you down. I promise you. I want to help you be able to get the message across, but without it being such a volatile situation. I don't know how much help it'll be because I don't know how receptive I am today, but to I'll sit here. You don't, you don't even have to future. say a word. OK, I'll just sit here. Like, But the minute like y'all start going and saying, well, you need to fix this, and you did this, and you did that yesterday, bitch, I just knows what I did yesterday. You didn't just call me a bitch, did you? No, I was just, no, 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 no. OK, sorry. Okay. It's like, it's like term, like, you know, like okay. straight term. Like, bitches, I was there. I know what I did. Elizabeth and Jamie have been on a roller coaster of emotions ever since marrying a stranger six weeks ago. They need to remember that even though you may love each other, you can't read your partner's mind. So it's important that they take a time out to really sit back and learn what it is that they're each really trying to say so they can learn from these misunderstandings because they can cause hurt, anger, and resentment.